This is the CMC Markets Connect Volatility Report. US banking stocks found support on Thursday morning after all 23 of the largest lenders in the country passed the Federal Reserve's stress test. The resulting 3.5% gain for JP Morgan stock was sufficient to leave the bank as one of the most active share prices, with one-day volatility coming in at 41.3% against 28.32% for the month. U.S. natural gas found itself as the most active commodity, bouncing off a one-week low in response to a smaller-than-expected build in the EIA gas stocks report. The initial reaction appeared to be overdone, however, with the underlying ending around 1% higher, despite having traded in a 5% range. One-day vol stood at 67.07% against 57.57% for the month. Sugar prices continued their run lower, with the raw contract posting its ninth successive day of losses on Thursday and testing lows for the quarter as a result. Continued strong production news out of Brazil remains a driving force here, although signs of some bargain hunting were in evidence ahead of the close. One day vol printed 54.6% against 45.73% for the month. And in fiat currencies, it was the greenback that stood out during the session. Hotter than expected final readings on Q1 GDP offered up some support for the US dollar, although this then proved to be rather short-lived. One-day vol on EURUSD stood at 7.38% against 6.36% for the month.